I'm Marlon Bergen with Comag Services. I've developed Comag Services started 10 years ago and I was uh, in the search for uh, water management uh, products and solutions essentially. So what I've developed over the last number of years is a mow plow and then what the mow plow has done is essentially it's it's assisted with subsurface drainage. It's assisted with uh, some uh, developed root structure into the soils. Uh, it also allows water movement throughout the soils that uh, has been able to increase uh, soil fertility, root growth, and move water throughout your soils. So what we're seeing is we're able to move uh, in saline ground, we're able to see the movement of uh, salinity or alkalinity throughout our soils. So having some water movement throughout the soils has uh, helped move some of the nutrients down or the salinity down and uh, been able to increase the root structure and growth. Uh, also we've been seeing is water movement from uh, low areas, uh, pothole areas that have been able to uh, traditionally instead of creating a surface drainage this has been able to run the water under the soil or disperse the water throughout the soil even if we don't have an inadequate outlet we're able to disperse that surface water throughout the soils we have a max depth of 48 inches so we've got the machine control systems using SD drain tile software together with a GPS system and then we can run on grade so if we have a lot of uh, train in differences in elevation we can still run and install our moles uh, on grade through the different soil depths. Over the last six years of working with the mole plow uh, we've seen tremendous results short term and we've also seen some of those results only uh, seen only the results four years later after we get some water movement throughout the soils. So in order to uh, increase longevity of the mole and the channel uh, the slope and depth is crucial. So we're we're looking at in, uh, the optimal depth if we're going to run junction with tile. So if we're looking at increasing the return on investment of tile, we can run our, our depth of our mole at the same optimal depth of our tile. So that we will run our mole depths diagonally to where the tile will be installed. And then we'll run our tile at that same optimal depth. If we have tile installed already and looking to further increase the impermeable layers of water movement through our soils, we will run our max depth plate above our tile lines and run our mold over our tile lines to help increase the water flow towards our tile through our soils. So one of, the, one of the big factors of me developing the mole plow is how can we minimize the cost in our traditional tile drainage projects. Uh, much of our projects we're looking at doing is uh, we're limited on costs obviously with the increased value of land and input costs and tile. This is a way to further uh, benefit on tile land by adding this feature to your land. Uh, this is the, uh, it's a low cost application that doesn't necessarily always replace tile, but it improves the efficiency of those high cost of tile installation projects. So if we don't have tile, uh, maybe it's a regulation, maybe it's uh, you have other obstacles that you can't overcome. This is a great way to fracture the soil and uh, just start to move water throughout your, throughout your soils without adding any pipe in the ground. So we've been developing this product over the last number of years. We put it onto the market uh, a year and a half ago. We are doing in full production for this summer, for this show at Regina. Uh, we have been uh, making lots of sales this spring and we've got full production that we'll have units available for, for the next month. So, uh, so units are available for this fall season. So go to comagservices.ca as well as uh, themoplow.ca and you'll find all the information there.